please be sure to subscribe to the channel to update the fastest and most accurate news. Hello everyone, welcome back to my journalism of the Heart News channel. The story for today is Olivia Fraser oozed sex appeal as she attended an event at Afterpay Australian Fashion Week 2022 on Monday. The married at first sight villain, who often opted for floaty dresses and hair scrunchies while appearing on the show, looked completely different as she posed for a sultry photo shoot at Sydney's Carriage Works. The 28-year-old teaching assistant from the Central Coast looked ultra-glamorous in a low-cut Beck and Bridge dress which showed off her curves to perfection. She placed her hand behind her head as she posed for the sexy shots, wearing her hair in rockstar bangs and whisked into a bun. She teamed her look with smoky dark eyeshadow and a nude lipstick, and added a pop of color to the outfit with a pair of pink heels. Olivia became the show's villain after she infamously outed her co-star Domenica Calaco as an OnlyFans model upon discovering one of her nude photos online. But last week, Liv told Daily Mail Australia that not only does she approve of OnlyFans, but she is also considering starting an account herself. I've never had a problem with OnlyFans, I used to work at a lingerie shop for years and have always been about embracing your sexuality, she said. I've been considering starting an OnlyFans account with Jackson, she added, referring to her boyfriend Jackson Loney, whom she met on MAFS. I'm not sure we will be doing it anytime soon, but it has definitely been discussed. My personality is one that's more likely to embrace OnlyFans and have an account than it is to ever shame someone for having one. Meanwhile, both Liv and Dominic are set to run into each other for the first time since the scandal erupted at After Party Australian Fashion Week. I'm not worried about seeing Domenica, laughed Olivia when asked by Daily Mail Australia how she felt about running into her former co-star. I wouldn't go up to her, that's for sure, but I also wouldn't run away, she said. I've done nothing wrong so I have no reason to run. Domenica, 29, meanwhile says that she has no respect for Olivia and would run the other way if she ran into her at an event. There's a level of respect, the respect I will give her is by never looking at her ever again if I see her in a room or at event I will walk the other way, she said. That is all for today news, please make sure to leave your comment and subscribe the channel below for more news update. Thank you for watching.